that is out for football has a special place on this most idyllic of days. This, of course, the fixture to which we've been looking forward so very, very much and for so very, very long. The scene could not be more beautiful. The pitch is pristine, the crowd basking in the sun, smiles on faces, a really good omen for the game, we hope. Well, the pre-match build-up has been fantastic. Now, the game itself. Bordeaux have chosen to go 4-3-3. Jim, how do you see it? Yes, and the importance of this formation is not to allow the midfield three and the attacking three to become too detached from one another. If that happens, then pressure can quickly be applied via the counter-attack and you can be exposed defensively. So compactness can't be compromised. And you need talkers in this team. You need leaders and people that are willing to organise things very quickly. Gets things running. Vash ah. And it's Fury. Fury. Daffer, Salvan. Achbar Tapchum. Lili. Oh, that's up. It's KK Rossi! He's got away with one there. the right wing. Deception. His positioning was spot on. Edgard. Daphne. Salman. You've done. You've done. Head over towards the opposite flank. Hendra. Sifuanto. Neil Lermans. Anything noteworthy in the early part of the match, Jim? Well, I think both teams probably feel it's it's too early for either to start taking real risks. So they're still very much in a phase of, of testing the waters and, and sizing each other up. Farrell, Lili Bali, and it's Kodinatsi. Kodinatsi, out to the left it goes. Away from immediate danger. Balls over the line, and it is a corner. And the header! Decent attempt, but not quite good enough. Well, that had the makings of something quite promising, but it's fizzled out into nothing. Katie Rossi. Did well to emerge with the ball. That's a contest to keep an eye on. And it's Sidney. This is promising. Geary. Foot in. Katie Rossi really struggling to influence the game. Ah, uh, he needs a minder, and one of his teammates should be picking up on that and quickly. And the assistant referee rightly gives him offside. a little off target and that's a good ball 
Move forward and quickly so. Adam Kutawa. Still goalless at the moment. Head guard. Asgar Tanchum. Proves too strong. Now the breakaway. And it's Kodinatsi. Kodinatsi. Kodinatsi! Big relief. It just needed better contact. It was very much worth a try, and I've seen worse. That should tee him up nicely for his next attempt. And it's been given away. And it's the goalkeepers to play. Edgard. He's found the way through. Into the box. Corner. to win the ball there. You've got shifted shift it upfield. Akbar Tapshop. And it's Ab Nilsson. Calmly anticipates. And cuts out a supply. Kiri. Katie Rossi. Go forwards. Borneo have turned up with a human block game. This is top defense. There is the hit! Oh, they really should have been made to pay. Well, I think the opposition was pretty sloppy in creating the problem for themselves then, but it was onto it so quickly and very nearly made them pay. Carries far too far and out of play. And it's cut in that seat. Kezo Nagu. Adelson. Oh, that's a nice ball. It's Mata right! Oh, he did the hard part right, but not the finish. Oh, it was such a clever. Oh, that is going to be the final action of the first half. But it has been a half largely of could haves and should haves. Perhaps the more impatient amongst the supporters will feel their overture a goal. But it's certainly not for the want of trying, so nothing to show as yet. At the break, it's nil-nil. Any strong opinions on the first half? Well, Peter, apart from the lack of goals, I really don't think there's, there's much to criticise. They've got to keep doing what they've been doing, and eventually they should find a way to the back of the net. Here's hoping for them. An engrossing half, but we're still where we started. Nil-nil. And we're off again. Borneo can feel really happy with themselves. The scoreline doesn't back it up, but they've played with urgency and purpose and can't afford to lose patience in this second half. They've got to persevere. Vajar cuts it out. Edgar Dapri really was well marshalled there because he was denied the opportunity to, to turn. Jakob, you've Rick. Kezo, Nambu. Adilson, Silver. Victor, shot a goal! He scores! First blood drawn. Yeah, I'd call that transition with bite. They won it back and, and bit hard.
Matthias Hill take the lead. Well, listen, a few words of advice and encouragement for the manager during the break can often straighten things out, and it's paid off here. Now it's keeping well safe. Oh, good ball, shots on here. Adilson, Silva. And it's been taken straight back. Neil Lund sends it forward. Adilson, Silva. Did well to step in there. That was more than necessary. Clearly not happy with... Pliony! It's it! They have pulled themselves right back into it. An act of charity gratefully received. Bordeaux grab the equaliser and we're all square. Oh, I think the coach will really be annoyed with that. The players were still thinking about their goal and just got caught napping. And he has been fouled there. Well, you might think he got off lightly. It is just a verbal warning. Silver, oh, good spread. Kezor, Naku. <laughs> Evan, Kutawa. Adilson, Silver. Narfan. Kezor, Naku. Narfan, and it's lofted through here. Oh, it's come loose. Infallible then, but that won't be the last they'll see of him. Well, you could see he was eager to get a shot away, but face to face with the key and the shots! Oh, that is rather wayward. Here he will be irritated with that, Peter. He really did spring into life as he made his run. So here comes a substitution. So we have a double substitution going on here. Erwin Gutawa forwards and with intent. Excellent challenge there, uncompromising. He's going to be disappointed with that. Hendro played out to the right. Yakov from Intercepted. Akbar Tamchong. Air guard. This is it then. Now or never. Now who's going to be first to this? Comes up. Very few marks for their attitude and application in trying to win this. It means an awful lot, obviously. Back into the middle. It's pretty They deserve an awful lot of credit for their commitment to the cause, but it's a goal credit that would be most welcome now. Can he finish? And no, he couldn't 
find the finish. So look, Lee Valley has delivered a really costly miss. It could have been their last chance to win it. Bordeaux have turned to their bench and we're going to have a substitution. I think you have to admire his willingness to keep plugging away, but the manager has, has done him a big favour, I think, by, by taking him off. You know, he was looking very, very leggy. Ooh. Perfectly measured that. He's left his man. And it's played forward. And they can counter here. Marks the light. Thinks one through. Concentration levels are very good, and so is the commitment. This game could yet yield a winner. Adelson, Silva, knocks it out wide. Looking for a corner. Bordeaux making another change here. Well, a stamina was called into question then, but there's absolutely nothing wrong with his heart and, and the efforts he put in. He was very willing, though, not quite able. Well, both sides might have to settle for a draw here, although there's still a chance for one last swing. Played right into his path. And the flag has stayed down. It's Toldani! Oh, what a wonderful stop! Toldani sparked a tremendous stop there, and I think it's fair to add, he just wasn't expecting it. Say Paolo, and in time is up, and there goes the whistle. Well, a game that had everything except a winner, really watchable, and honours even. And after all of that, Jim, what are you thinking? Born